Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. In this video we will continue with record level security in Salesforce in that we will see sharing rule and manual sharing in Salesforce. So in previous video we have seen organization wide default then roles and role hierarchy in Salesforce. Now we will see sharing rules and manual sharing. The video link of OWD and roles in Salesforce I have given in description box you can go through it. Now we have seen when the OWD is private then only roles sharing rules and manual sharing is come to the picture. So we have seen roles when the OWD is private at that time CEO can see manager's record and employee record manager can see employees record and employees can see only those record which owned by themselves. Now in some situations employee wants to see managers and CEOs record using the role hierarchy it's not possible because as per the role hierarchies only higher positions user can see lower position users records but what if employee want to see managers and CEOs record that time sharing rule and manual sharing takes place. So what is the sharing rule in Salesforce in Salesforce sharing rule extend sharing access to users in public groups and roles allowing them access to records they don't own. That means the record owned by the manager role the employee cannot see them. That time sharing role can allow us to see that record which they don't own. Then there are three types of sharing rule criteria based sharing rule owner based sharing rule and then manual sharing. Now first we will see criteria based sharing rule. So in the criteria based sharing rule these rule shares record based on specific field values within the records. So quickly jump to the org then I will demonstrate you how to share records using criteria based sharing rule. So before that quickly I show you the users role for that in quick find box search for users then click on users. So here you can see I have three users assigned to employee roles then one user to CEO role and then one user to manager role. Now as per the role hierarchy CEO can see employee and managers roles record and then manager can see employees roles record. Now we want to give access to the employee roles users so they can see managers and CEOs record. So to active the sharing role in quick find box search for sharing settings. So here you can see in the security option we have sharing settings click on it. Then we know we can only use roles sharing roles and manual sharing on the object which OWD is private. So here I am using bank account custom object. So I am searching bank account. Here you can see the bank account object which OWD is private. Now to activate the sharing rule for bank account you need to scroll down and here you can see we have bank account sharing rules. Now we don't have any sharing rule for that I am going to create new rule. Click on new button then enter the rule name share records as you click on role name it will automatically populate then you can enter the description and here we have two types of sharing rules we have based on record owner and then based on criteria first I will demonstrate you based on criteria for that click on based on criteria rule and then here you need to select which record to be shared that means here you can select the fields which are present in the bank account object then operator and then value for example, for example, I have account priority field, then select operator equals and here when we use the pick list value field, here you can see the lookup icon will be available, click on it. Now here we need to select the value so that all records meet this criteria that will be shared. So here I am going to select high and then insert selected. Then in the first step, select the users to share with. Now as you click on share with option we have public groups then roles and then roles and subordinate. So before they apply the sharing rule I will show you by login with another user whether they can see each other's record or not. For that click on setup then in the quick find box search for users click on users. Now I will login with any employee profile user here I am login with MI once click on login button then go to the bank account object and then select all list view. Now here you can see this MI once which on employee profile user and on employee role this role user can access only those record which owned by themselves. Now this user doesn't have access to read create or delete other users record. Now I am going to log out with this user and then we'll see login by another role user. Here you can see manager role user. Now I logged in as Abhijit Rai which is on manager profile user or manager role then click on bank account then select all list view and here you can see he can access his own record with his record he can access also another user's record. Now log out this user coming to the sharing rule 
Now what is the use of this criteria based sharing rule? In this rule, all records with account priority equals to high that will be shared with public group roles or roles or subordinate. Here I want to select these records with public groups. As I click on public groups, here you, here you need to select the group you have created. Here I have two groups, all internal users and then employee group. This employee group that I have created, the video link of how to create public group I have given in description box, you can go through it. I am selecting employee group. And then in the fifth step, we can select access level. That means we can give read only or read write. Here I am clicking on read write access and then click on save button. Here pop up will be open, here you need to click on ok button. As you click on ok button, then scroll down. And then here you can see in the bank account sharing rules, we have one activated sharing rule. Now we have shared this record with the group. Now as I click on public group and then click on employee group and then click on view all users. As I click on MI once and then click on login button. This user is on employee profile and employee role has been assigned to this user. Even as I click on bank account and then click on all list view. Now this user can access the other users record also. That means in the criteria based sharing rule, which criteria we have assigned according to that criteria, the record will be shared. Now here I have entered the criteria with account priority equal to high. Now this employee role user can access others record which account priority is high. Now we will see owner based sharing rule. For that I am logging out this user and then in the sharing setting click on new button to create new rule owner based sharing rule as you click on rule name it will automatically populate and now in the rule type we need to select based on record owner now in the third step we don't need to select the criteria but here we need to select which record to be shared and here we need to select owned by members of that means here we have options public group roles and subordinate here I want to share all the records those are owned by the manager role that can be accessed to the employee role also. For that I have selected roles and then here select manager. Here you can see manager click on it and then in the first step select the users to share with. Now here select roles and then employee. Then give the access level read only or read write. I am selecting read write then click on save button. Now again scroll down and go to the bank account object. Here first I am deleting this criteria based sharing rule because of conflict. For that click on delete then click on ok button. Again scroll down and go to the bank account object. We will see that sharing rule has deleted. Now here you can see in the criteria owner in role manager and the record of owned by the manager role that shared with employee role. Now go to the users and here we have three users assigned to employee role. I am going to log in with MI once, then go to the bank account. In the list view, select all list view. And now here you can see this user can access other users record even this account priority is not high. That means in the owner based sharing rule, this rule share record based on the ownership of the records. Now we will see manual sharing. Now when the manual sharing takes place, even we have criteria based sharing rule and owner based sharing rule. In the manual sharing allows us individual users to grant access to specific record to other users. That means in the criteria based sharing rule and owner based sharing rule, we need to share record in the group or set of group. But in the manual sharing, we can share only one record to the other users. Let's see in the org. Now I will show you how to use manual sharing in Salesforce. And now you need to select on edit button. Then as you scroll down, here you can see manual user record sharing. You need to check this checkbox and then click on save button. Now go to the app launcher. Now search for the object. Here you can see bank account object. Click on it. And now I want to share this Burlington textiles record to the other users. For that we need to open this record. And then here you can see the drop down arrow. Click on it. And then here you can see we have sharing options as you click on it and here we need to select to whom we want to share this record user public group role or role and subordinate here I want to share this record to the particular user for that click on user and then we need to search for the user I want to share this user with Akash Gupta for that you can search here and click on it and then bank account access level 
you can give read only or read write i am giving read write and then click on save button now here you can see record share data for akash gupta was created now i am going to log in with akash gupta for that click on login button then go to the bank account as i select all list view now here you can see he can access the berlin time textiles record this is the use of manual sharing in salesforce now in this video we have seen types of sharing rules criteria based sharing rule owner based sharing rule and the manual sharing rule then we have seen difference between all of them and why is manual sharing is different than criteria based sharing rule and manual sharing rule so i hope you have got an idea about record level security in that in previous video we have seen owd then roles and in this video we have seen sharing rules and manual sharing in salesforce if you like the video hit the like button subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon to get regular updates thank you